For the third straight year, areas of eastern Connecticut could see a gypsy moth infestation. And that could mean a defoliation of more than 200,000 acres of trees. Today, the state entomologist and the state forester showed News 8 what egg casings look like. Each casing can contain hundreds of eggs. The drought caused past infestation, so fingers are crossed for a rainy spring. Without the early uh, the spring and early summer rains, we haven't seen our gypsy moth fungus, Entomophaga mega mega, kick in and control the gypsy moth population. If trees are in a compromised state to begin with, um, they're really going to suffer, and some may not make it. If you see those egg casings, they say you can scrape them off, put them in soapy water, or soak them in a mixture of water and soybean oil to suffocate them.